Russia is likely preparing to launch a massive missile strike on Kiev in revenge for its failure on the Kursk front, the Times reports. In recent days, the Ukrainian armed forces have made significant progress in the Kursk region, which President Volodymyr Zelensky recently indirectly acknowledged. On Saturday, he said that Ukraine is advancing the war into the territory of the aggressor. A senior Ukrainian defense source told the Times that Ukraine expected an aggressive response from Russia in the form of, of an attempted missile strike on important targets in Kyiv. In particular, the Russians could try to attack the Vakovna Rada and other government buildings. Russia feels the need to give a very tough response, something grandiose, to show the whole world that it is all-powerful and that something like Kursk will not go unpunished, the source said. Recently, the Russians had already carried out a test attack with six missiles. Four were flying towards Kiev, two towards Poltava. As a result of this attack, a man and a four-year-old child were killed in the Kiev region. According to preliminary data, they were killed by a North Korean missile. The Times source believes that a Russian attack in retaliation for the Kursk region would likely involve far more than four missiles. There could be hundreds using sophisticated weapons, cruise missiles, ballistic missiles and martyrs, and this could be a big problem for our air defense. But I believe we can stop them, the source told the publication. Russia accused Ukraine of committing terrorist acts on Russian territory and promised a harsh response. According to Russian Foreign Ministry spokesperson Maria Zakharova, the operation in Kursk Oblast allegedly has only one goal, to intimidate the civilian population. Having voiced the usual threats against Ukraine, Zakharova began to appeal to the international community, demanding that it condemn Ukraine's attacks. Russian volunteers collected humanitarian aid worth more than a million rubles and loaded it into a military Kamaz vehicle to be delivered to Russian servicemen in Ukraine's Luhansk region. However, the aid was not delivered to the Russian position due to an attack by a Ukrainian drone that dropped an incendiary mixture on it. Following this, the humanitarian aid burned along with the truck transporting it. A projectile fired from the drone hit the vehicle in the front row of the convoy of several Kamaz trucks, causing an explosion. The vehicle with gas cylinders caught fire while it was moving. As a result, in addition to the humanitarian aid in the vehicle, the military supplies, including the radio-electronic combat equipment also burned. Volunteers have stated that the Kamaz vehicle belonging to the military unit needs to be repaired. They also stated that they would collect aid to buy new radio-electronic combat equipment to replace the destroyed one. It should be noted that most of the territory of Luhansk region is under Russian occupation.
Пошел один. Ты пидорас такой взял. Вы пидорасы, сука. А? 